Right. So, this is The Elder Scrolls 2, Daggerfall. It's in a quirky window because, of course, it is. I, uh, this is freeware. Daggerfall is freeware these days. I installed it on my computer last week. I've been itching to play this again for several months. And when I say itching, I mean, well, it'd be pretty fun if I played Daggerfall again. And then I think about it and I go, well, that's fucking stupid. Why the fuck would you say something that's stupid? And then I let it go. And then later on I go, uh, yeah. yeah, let's play Daggerfall again. I'm like, eh, no, it's a terrible idea. But here we are all the same. And I thought if I was going to play Daggerfall again, I'd have to uh, do some Daggerfallian conducts or some shit or another. So due to the awkward resolution, I put uh, the picture of the box art. I think I still have the box somewhere. It's probably too crumpled and broken at this point. So... I'm also going to have to adjust uh, sound volumes at some point. That is something I did not do before starting this broadcast. So uh, things will probably be too loud for you, and you'll hiss and boo and scream. So I'm going to try turning this down to 10% for you kids, and let's see how this sounds. Alright, so how is that? We have a good, have a bad, better one or better two, even though I didn't give you a better two yet. Fine. All right. Sounds okay. Okay. So now we'll do that while I'm talking. And we'll do something like that. Get out of here. I love in my activity log, whenever I have people banned and unbanned, whenever it shows that I kicked Slagsor for 600 seconds, it showed, uh, it shows the image. Like, it tells you, like, what messages inspired, like, the kicking and the unkicking, and the banning and the unbanning. Alright. Well, so, the first step of the possibly lengthy create character creation process to Daggerfall, although it doesn't have to be, you can easily choose one and just pop them in, but is selecting your home province. If you're unfamiliar with the game, uh, Daggerfall is my favorite Elder Scrolls game, and it's not even close. Uh, I don't have a desire to go back and play Arena, or uh, Morrowind, or Oblivion, uh, or Battlespire, or Redguard. Uh, Daggerfall is my faves. I can't even argue that it's a good game, but it's my favorite Elder Scrolls game. A variety of provinces, for those of you familiar with Elder Scrolls lore, you might be familiar with the value of those provinces. I can turn the game sounds a bit up. I turned them down just like a preemptive thing. We'll see how that 20% goes. Uh, we'll be able to better gauge things whenever we actually get to the music. Anyway, High Rock, Hammerfell, Skyrim, Morrowind, Black Marsh, Elsewhere, <laughs> Valenwood, and Somerset Isle. Well, I'm gonna be from Somerset Isle. I know. High Elves hail from the province of Somerset. You are part of a tall, golden-skinned people, extremely intelligent, agile, and willful. The magical nature of Somerset Isle has made the High Elves natural spellcasters who are immune to paralyzing poisons and... Spells. Now, among the many things that were intended when this game was released was for your uh, race to matter when it came to your attributes. However, this is completely overwritten, uh, and so it ends up not mattering. Uh, the only aspects which end up mattering in regards to race are some of the extraneous benefits. Like, for example, High Elves are completely immune to paralysis. Let's be a little cheesy with this conduct. We'll be male. They're gonna be female and go, Woo! Take off the clothes and see the breasts. Because it's not like you can see those or anything on the internet in this day and age. And let's go ahead and choose from a list. And let's be custom. So, today's conduct 
is brought to you by No Magic. That's right. No Magic. I haven't done a No Magic run of Daggerfall in a while. It's got to be pretty awesome. And when I say pretty awesome, I mean holy fuck, is this going to be painful? I can pick one other thing. Let's forbid myself bucklers. You know what? Screw that. Let's forbid myself archery. Archery's dumb. Yes. Now, I picked a bunch of disadvantages there. Oh god. Oh god. Forgot about this part. My ears. Right, so, if you're unfamiliar with the custom character creation process of Daggerfall, I'll try to paraphrase it a bit. You get to build your own class. Now, it's actually designing a class instead of the character you have who's going to be playing for that class. So, what kind of requirements or at least minimum attributes would you need in order to be a member of that class? Well, my character won't be doing much spell casting, and by much I mean pfft. So, intelligence? Who needs it? Intelligence is only used for, like, the language skills, like lockpicking, I think medical, it's rubbish. The hell with it. Willpower? Kind of applies to magical resistance, so it's not bad to have. But in regards to skills, it only applies to those magic casting skills. So who needs that? Now Kyler Nadia raises a great point. No magic. Have fun walking. We need to get to where we need to go fast. So that's kind of important. We're also going to need to be, uh... We're also going to need to have some muscle to us. Because if we can't use magic to solve our problems, we're going to have to use fisticuffs. You understand? Right. So, now my character will be incredibly durable and incredibly fast, but he's not very intelligent and he's rather submissive. We still have 30 points here to play around with. Now, I have been known to tank luck in this game. But, I mean, if we're gonna go with a no magic playthrough, I think I'm gonna need a help man. Let's do anti-me and be lucky. And with these five points, ah, I don't need any personality, I don't need any endurance. Let's go with agility. Class name, the chuckle fuck. Now, we have the maximum number of disadvantages here. Uh, I cannot regenerate spell points at all, meaning I would have to re-drink uh, potions, I do believe, in order to get those back. Uh, I'm completely unable to use magic in darkness or daylight. And I have a critical weakness to paralysis, which is overridden by my racial immunity to paralysis. Yup. And forbidden weaponry, missile weaponry. Ah, archery is, is pretty shaky in this game. But since I won't have magic, that means I'm not going to have a ranged option. Oh well. We're gonna have up to 30 maximum hit points per level. Of course, uh, that's a maximum number that isn't guaranteed every time you level. You could save scum in order to uh, fix that. Well, <laughs> I don't have it in me. Now, advantages wise, we're gonna need some help. We're gonna need some help. So, let's get some help. Why don't we uh, get some general regenerate health so that my character can. Uh, put himself back together. We might as well get general rapid healing as well. Because, oh hell, we're gonna need all the help we can get. Believe you me, we're going to need all of the help that we can get. It's not even, it's not even, it's not even exaggeration. Um, 
Let's see, what else do I want to, uh, thing? I don't think I want to pick Spell Absorption. The reason for that is I'll have a very small Magicka pool, and uh, Spell Absorption that exceeds your Magicka pool will actually damage you. I could do some resistances or immunities. Uh, I don't like disease. That's pretty dumb. You could do, like, a critical weakness to disease and, like, wrap over so that you're immune to the disease. <sighs> Let's just not worry about it. I think I can still get Vamprism and Lycanthropy despite being immune to disease. Maybe that'll be something I show off in this impromptu thing. I'm not going to pursue the main quest line. What the hell do I know, right? If I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. I just don't like diseases. Um, who does, right? We'll also have some bonus to hit humanoids. Bonus to hit... Daedra. Alright, that took me right to uh, the dagger line there. Tomorrow we sail for the kingdom of Dagger Line. Bonus to hit humanoids and bonus to hit Daedra. Daedra's a really long-reaching one. Do I really want to do Daedra? I mean, I'm not going to be fighting any Daedra for a long time, if at all, on this playthrough. I could pick, like, a bonus to, like, a weapon thing. Ah, screw it. It'll be fine. That is not true. You do not auto-fail the main quest if you ignored for too long. You just have to know uh, what you're doing and the prompt that you have to see. Primary skills! Well, uh, we'll do some long blade. That's pretty boring. I did it. Uh, I used a blunt weapon, I believe, in my, uh, my playthrough for this on my channel. It has been a while ago. With some critical strike. And... Hmm. This is the point where I'm out of ideas. Dodging, I'll say. Major skills. We want to have some nice mixes here. So why don't we go with... Uh... I can't believe I'm going to pick this. Lock picking. <laughs> These are dark times that I'm picking lockpicking as a skill. Holy shit. Oh, man. Uh, lockpicking... Probably gonna do... <sighs> Mercantile. Or medical. I mean, I do regenerate pretty high rapidly. I don't think I need medical as this. I have it. Mercantile. And I'm gonna pick Mysticism. There's a reason why I'm picking Mysticism. Although it probably doesn't have to be a major skill, I think I can have that as a minor. So let's scrap that. I guess I'll do Medical. I guess. I guess. All that ordering bothers me, though. Medical? Uh, no. Centaurian. Bear with me here. Medical. Mercantile. Better. Why doesn't it bother me up there? But it bothers me there. I'm not going to change it up here. Well, because I like that order, and I don't like... I'm not used to having these skills as major skills. Right, anyway. Let's get some backstabbing. Some climbing. Some jumping. Some mysticism. Some running. And some short blade. Hmm. I don't like that. Alteration? The destruction. Oh, that fucks with my order. Climbing, destruction, jumping, mysticism, running, and short blade. Okay. Long blade, critical strike, dodging, lock picking, medical, mercantile, climbing, destruction, jumping, mysticism, running, and short blade. Uh, the default classes in this game, many are constructed rather poorly in regards to their skills. Uh, in all honesty, you're not going to use that many weapons at once. Uh, you want to use the best weapon that you end up finding. Uh, long blades are the strongest in the game. Uh, pound for pound. That sounded dumb. Uh, but I do like to have a backup 
uh, and the minor skills. That's a short blade. Uh, just, just guys, just guys. No, no reason or anything. Just, just liked it because reasons. Reputations. Well, scholars hate me because I'm pretty dumb. The nobility. They like me because I'm pretty dumb. Peasants. Who cares about peasants? And merchants. We're not that bad. Because I'm pretty dumb. Right. Class name, Chucklefuck. Skill advancement for class. This slider determines how many skill upgrades you have to make uh, before you level up. Uh, leveling in the Elder Scrolls II Daggerfall is not built on experience points. It's built on how many skill checks you make. It's a thing. Cool. I want to choose my character's path by answering 12 important career decisions. At an early age, your family considered it important that you learn how to slit my throat and die. I mean, that's probably not right. <laughs> that's probably not right at all. Okay. I have my convenient tell me what all of the background things do modifier page up here. So useful. Why don't we, uh, most useful here, I think, is going to be my uh, minor skill one. And we're going to choose fight with a knife, just in case I end up with a knife. You were an active child? I was. I'll take it. Mm, I think I'm going to have that be running. Faster I run, the faster I can move in this crazy world. You can get most of the things you want by stealing from... Yeah, it's gonna be scholar types. Books are pretty valuable in this game. The one skill you could not work without must be... The game is flavoring me as a burglar, a uh, roguish type, because of the skill selection I have. Uh... So that's a thing. I would, I think, increase... Dodging can go up pretty well. Uh, it's a primary skill. Uh, but something I'm going to have problems increasing is going to be lockpicking. Ah, let's do backstabbing. What the hell? Fuck, egg. Fuck increasing that important shit. Though, uh, certainly not due to hard work, you happen to... You happen legitimately to own an ebony dagger. Yes. What thieving skill have you been practicing the longest? I'm used to seeing, like, magical-related things over here. Now this one... Hmm. Probably gonna have that be critical striking. Although I did choose backstabbing earlier, but... Critical striking. But backstabbing. But critical striking is a primary skill, and I can increase that really quickly. And that influences my maximum... You know, reasons. Backstabbing. Where in your exp... Alright, sure. Short-bladed weapons. As a child, your nickname was... Don't you sass me, uh, search thing. Yeah. Let's go ahead and be Quicksilver. I was pretty sure that's the one I wanted to be. What motivates you into a life of burglary? <laughs> you, uh, didn't know that I was interested in this, now did you? Uh, doesn't actually say... I uh, will say... I'm in it for the lulls. What god, if any, do you worship? I suppose I will, Madachi. And this broadcast may go longer than midnight. Depends on my mood. I so seldom choose a god. Probably won't be god of logic. Uh, why don't we have... Akatosh, the god of time. Nah, no god. Your frail health as a child has made you less resistant to disease. Wink, wink. Your preferred criminal method is... I'm seeing a lot of repetition here. Hmm. I don't know this one either. All options increase your reputation with the same unknown faction and add something to your background, but the answer makes no impact on your character. I see. 
Well then, my preferred criminal record method is bank robbing, baby. And I have a higher reputation of the scholars. Holy shit. Praise the scholars. No. Let's go ahead and, uh... I didn't really think about what I wanted to name my character. <laughs> no, 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 no. As if there were any doubt. Deckard Kane. All right, these fucking high elf portraits. Oh, I forgot. I liked this one the most as a kid. I think I'm gonna stick with that one. <sighs> Alright, let's re-roll a few times. Until I get 14 bonus points, and then we'll call it a day. That'll be good enough. What did I win? Eh. Let's go ahead and even out those. Uh, every tenth point... Uh, gets you some spiffy cool bonuses, if you haven't noticed. I have a whopping nine spell points to my name. Holy shit! That's amazing! Let's go ahead and work on that luck. Gonna need some luck. Skills-wise. Running in short blader up to a whopping 22%. Not entirely sure... I mean, running is so easy to train. Why would I bother to increase that, right? And yet, here we are. I'm gonna increase mysticism. Yeah, I think I think that's what I want to do. Let me uh, let me check a thing, just to make sure that's the thing I want to increase. I have to. Uh... Damn, I can't find it. I'm about to say fuck it. I have played through this game so many times. Nah, I think I want to do it the 20. I think that's correct. I don't think it... I think that's the minimum for joining something. It might be 22. That is 22. Okay. Well, good. I have enough points. Uh, I don't plan on casting a single spell. I just want to be able to join uh, a few guilds. So that increased. Moving right along, we're going to go ahead and get Longblade up, because that'll be pivotal. <laughs> Actually, that's going to be pretty easy to train. Why don't we uh, increase these up? And then for major skills, I think I'm going to put that all into lockpicking. I think, I think, I think. Yep. Very high. That'll be good. 91 luck. What kind of fucking playthrough is this? It's not me, that's for sure. Weird-ass character concept. You skipped my opening cinematic! How dare you skip my opening cinematic! I did not click. You fucking game. You wake and look around the room. Some hours ago, you were fuck you. Save. I... that is unacceptable. Of course, whenever I click exit game, it doesn't actually take me to the fucking main menu, because why would you be useful, Daggerfall? I demand my cutscene. Can we have fewer points to assign? That didn't really save me any time. You will give me my cutscene. You will not fuck this up. 
average. Thank you. Four hundred years after Tiger Septimus reign, the beginning will meet the end and the bloody circle will close at the Empire of Tamriel. The unworthy heirs of the Septim dynasty have allowed the bonds of the Empire to weaken and crack. Uriel Septim, the seventh, cannot repair what his ancestors ignored. The provinces fight among themselves like neglected children, drunk with rebellion, and one indomitable power hides itself, but not forever. Excuse the gloom, but none may know of this meeting. The nature of my trouble is darker still. Over a year ago, King Lysandus of Daggerfall died honorably on the field of battle. He was as loyal a subject, ally, and friend as you are. I did grieve for him, but his spirit does not rest. With a spectral army, he haunts his former kingdom, crying for revenge. I do not know why a good and loyal man would be so cursed. Perhaps you can find the answer and close the marble jaws of oblivion, bringing peace to his soul. I ask this as your emperor and as your friend. I have one lesser request. Several years ago, I wrote a letter to the Queen of Daggerfall. It never arrived. The letter was of a sentimental and personal nature. If you find and destroy that letter, I will be grateful. Now, my champion, rest well this night. For tomorrow, tomorrow you sail, sail for, for the kingdom, kingdom of Daggerfall. And the description is provided uh, in the uh, instruction manual, which they, that should be on the shelf, shouldn't it be? Ah, I don't feel like showing it off right now. Might have to get back some CDs. You wake and look around the room. Some hours ago, you were in a boat on route to Daggerfall, when a storm of supernatural strength boiled over the Iliac Bay like a malefic creature. Your boat was destroyed, but you managed to swim through the churning water to a promontory, promontory rock. There, you found a cave and escaped the fury of the storm. You had only just lit a small fire when a mudslide sealed you within. Your fear being buried alive calm when you saw the corridor leading out of the cavern. Perhaps there is a way out of this cave after all. Once free of the cave, you can begin the Emperor's quest. Privateer's hold is so vicious that it has a little guide uh, that came with the box. And even then, it would still kill you. I've, uh... I guess you could say I've speedrun this, of sorts, on the channel just to show how quick it is to get through Privateer's Hold. We're not going to be doing any of that right now, though. In part because we need to see sound in volume levels compared to me, folks. Like, I'm probably going to cut the music to, like, right there. As for the sound, fucking beats me. Beats me. Controls wise, I just configured these like an hour before the broadcast. They went. They weren't bad even on Max. Hmm. And I'm using view based. Right. So take a look around. See if I remember my own damn control scheme. I swear I change this crap every time I play this game. Look at that amazing speed at work. 
Equipment-wise, we have ourselves an Ebony Dagger, which we're going to equip. Set of Iron Gauntlets. I usually forbid myself iron. We also have the Pig Children by Tyson Bane. Woohoo! Look at us. Powerful. Idiotic. Passive. Aggressive. Nimble. Very healthy. Interesting. Lightning fast. Divinely favored. With some skills in things and stuff. We of course have our log which tells us our mission. And we have ourselves a history. Well, you were born to a peasant family in a tiny village in the shores of Somerset. Your parents and older brothers were hard workers, proud of their strength and endurance. The only thing big about you is your appetite. You were of an inquisitive nature. No cupboard, closet, or drawer was safe from your prying eyes and fingers. You left no traces, but still your father and brothers beat you and they caught you. By the time you were eleven, they no longer caught you. Your mother taught you knife fighting and racing, but you had no other schooling and wanted none. Once, you climbed the wall of the local mages' guild and spied on the young novices of practice. When their equipment was left lying about, you took it for your own. In this way, you acquired a book. You also adopted a jacket shed by its owner and wore it proudly about the village. One day, you saw some village boys hurling stones and insults at an old woman named Nefetav. Fuck that name. Moved by an impulse you did not understand, you flung rocks back at the boys. They laughed. But as you drew near, they turned and ran away. You went back to see... You went back to Nephi and offered to see her at to her door. Come inside, Nephi said. I have something for you. Her cottage was just one room with cats and kittens everywhere. Sit down, she said, removing two cats from a stool. I'm going to teach you about backstabbing. Why, you asked. The cats don't need training in backstabbing. Did her name change? I think her name changed. She said, You do, or will, no matter. Thus your training began. Her hands could no longer perform, but her mind was still efficacious. You and she became friends, as well as students to teach the cats don't need training in backstabbing. <laughs> oh, shit. On your 16th birthday, she told you that you must leave. Your little village was too small for someone of your talents. What of you, you asked? I also must move on. Perhaps someday you will visit me in the Iliac Bay. I would like that. Until then, I have my memories and my cats. On your way to the Imperial City, you stopped in... You stopped at an inn and heard that the Emperor was to pass the next day. Instead of sneaking into a room, you spent the night in a tree beside the road. You wanted to see the Emperor. Later, there would always be chances to begin studying the layout of the local bank. The procession was very splendid indeed, but a nearby rustle drew your attention. A black-clad man was crouching on a limb ten feet beneath you. You gasped before you could stop yourself and he twisted around, bringing his bow to bear on you. With no time to draw a weapon, you flung yourself at him, and together you crash down on the heads below, just as the Emperor's carriage drew abreast. Hands seized you roughly. You felt dizzy, and a trail of fire burned along your left arm. Poison! Then a white-robed elf muttered an incantation over you. Your arm cooled, and your head cleared. The Emperor himself thanked you, and gave you a dagger wrought of ebony. The local folk treated you to drinks and food, in unaccustomed praise. Later you slipped away and found that in addition to an ebony dagger, the Emperor had handed you a note, inviting you to share an audience with him at the Imperial Palace. You set out, immediately. And that's how we immediately became friends with fucking Uriel Septim himself. Right. So, let's go ahead and use this shirt. Let's, uh, let's, uh, seal that up a bit there. Now, you said I had a jagged, but I don't have a jagged. We have a book here which I can read. I don't feel like reading anymore right now. Okay. Let's see if I can remember my controls. I got this. Totally got this. I don't got this. Alright. 
I already forgot which key I set the jump and which key I set the activating things. Uh, spacebar is usually the activation key for this stuff. And I turned it to mouse one because I wanted to use spacebar to jump. Bye, guys. Fucking scrub lords. Get out of my face. I don't love you. No one loves you. Bye, bat. I'm too used to spacebar being the activation key. It's fucking with me. Bye, Archer. Hi, skeleton. Get me out of here. Bye, skeleton. Now this fucking imp coming up can wreck your shit. He is the gatekeeper. Well, that was fun. And that's how you clear out of a very difficult starting dungeon. Auto map not available here. Not in town. Privateer's Hold is right here. Let's go ahead and run south, the Gothway Garden. Yeah, that head bobbin shit. No, we could have gone it we could have stayed in there and killed people and got loot. There's no need for that. Yeah. Just listen to the sweet tunes as I bounce around out here with my ebony dagger. Not a care in the world. You could easily get up the level too in Privateer's Hold. But, I mean, why would I do that? That's no fun. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I might very well do that, Sober Dwarf. There is a, uh, there are a few taverns where I can get the goods. I'm, uh, unaccustomed to playing the game with eye luck. We'll see how it goes. I turned off magic. Heaven forbid I'd be exploiting. So this is just to give you an indication, in case you've forgotten, or maybe you didn't know, of what real-time travel is like in Daggerfall. I believe uh, the size of the Iliac Bay in this game is uh, greater than the size of the United Kingdom. We made it to Gothway Garden, though. Yay! And I was running and jumping along the way, because I can. I should also put my weapon away. I'm rather familiar with Gothway Garden, having spent quite a bit of time here in my day. It sounded so obnoxious. Use the arrows to scroll, but not west. Yeah, whatever. That's the Mage's Guild right there. Now the Temple, that's the Temple of Zenithar, I think. A little cluster of rubbish shops, that's the Fighter's Guild, Temple of Kinnereth. Good place, good place, good place. Nice starting location. What time is it? Alright, cool. I don't need you scrubs to identify these places for me. Get out of my face. Get into my car. I want a tavern, though. Hmm. I'd probably, probably go join the Fighters Guild. Go do that. So I can get some, I can get some sleep. Good thing I uh, buffed up that running stand, right, guys? My fatigue meter is already shot to hell from all the jumping and running I've done. I'm too used to spacebar being my activation key in this game. Me changing it to a left mouse button has completely fucked me over. Can I join? Yay! I did it! Now, uh, the premier feature of joining the Fighters Guild is that you always have a place to rest. This guy can repair things, she trains you, the guy I joined the guild from gives you random quests to do things. It's pretty exciting. We need a nap, though. Now, it doesn't take us very long to heal courtesy of our amazing 
regenerate health prowess, as well as rapid healing that I've selected. So even with a poor medical skill, I do pretty alright. Yeah, she'll train you alright. I uh, don't have much gold to my name. Courtesy of the fact that I didn't loot around Privateer's Hall. Got a quest you got for me. House here in town? Sure. The Wixley Residence. I'll go find it. Probably. Actually, the peasants are no longer walking around outside. Uh, so, location. That This is probably a terrible idea for me to ask about. General. Now I'm gonna have to look for this thing manually. I made a terrible mistake. Why did I select this job again? Right, because I'm stupid. I might already load the game. Okay. So if I were the Wixley residence, I'd be somewhere north of here. Problem is that there's a lot of places north of here. Probably gonna load the, probably gonna load the game, game. <laughs> Fucking water. Alright, so, if I were the Wixley residence, yeah, I can go to the tavern and ask, but they'll only give me generic directioning. It's only people outside who mark stuff on your map. Yes, I know I see you. Control scheme. Uh, talk mode. F4. Or I can do grab mode, that works. Talk. <laughs> Fucking asshole. Northeast, huh? Alright. I can try to do research here. Ha! Ah. How about that, guys? I'm a winner. As I jump for joy, because once again, I'm too fucking used. Oh, this shit. I hate whenever these ladders get involved. Come here. I'm gonna hug ya. That was me hugging it, and I'm not hearing my satisfied kill enemy sounds. What the hell's with that game? Come on. Rats. 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 Oh! Oh! Oh, what? Oh! Oh! Really? Are you fucking kidding me? I started stealing from a rat and the guards? <laughs> you guards you guys are clearly in league with the rats huh and then it teleported me here I said I wasn't gonna surrender damn it well that was a thing I said I wasn't gonna give up, and they fucking took me to jail anyway. It's weird. It's a tiger, huh? Well, let's go fight this thing instead, and maybe try not to pickpocket it, I guess. Oh, you bastard. You! Talk to me. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Mission accomplished, everyone.
Put up a banner and everything. Oh, maybe it wasn't. Oh, no, it definitely was. Uh, uh, no. Yeah, sure. I'll do that. Oh, crap. Supposed to be broken? I'll take it! Was this broken too? Oh damn. Fuck, now I have to go to a dungeon. Fuck. I've signed my own death warrant. <laughs> oh well. Troublesome werewolf, werebore, whatever. Theodric Laboratory. I'm pretty sure I've been there before. Yes, it was only slightly broken, with some missions. But... What the hell is going on with you, Daggerfall? This is what I get for using that Comp USA special patch and that installer. I have quirks that I'm unfamiliar with in this game, as opposed to quirks I'm familiar with. I'm like staring at the game all suspicious-like and shit. Alright, well, anyway, let's go to the primary attraction of Daggerfall. Random dungeon! I don't even own a wagon. Just thought of that. Oh well. So be it. This is totally not how I play the game to start off. But here we are all the same. Hi, guy! Hey! How's it going, guy? Who did that? Ah, oh, shit. My only saving grace here is that humanoids scale with your level. So I'm level one, so they are correspondingly not that powerful. Ooh, plus three. Take it, put it in the bag. So that's my mission accomplished thing before I took the, the shit. Dungeon fucked one. So our mission here, should we choose to accept it, is find a where whatever thing. Hiding somewhere within this entire dungeon in one of several quest locations. The only way for us to progress right now is for me to fall. Oh, it's a lock. I thought so. Get it! Get it! Get it! I'm gonna break my ebony tiger doing this shit. That's just a treasure room. Welp, we're already off to an I'm fucked start. Yeah. Yeah, good good on me for using a lockpick skill, right guys? that I'd make this a no magic run. There we go. Uh, chains uh, usually are imbued with magic like that to allow you the opportunity to survive something if you don't have magic. Of course, this game being what it is, it looks really fucking weird. That was good enough for me to... Hmm. Unfortunately, you can't control yourself whenever you're doing that falling. Uh, I was kind of stuck in the wall. Now I'm going to have to try to climb my way out. 
Let me tell you how well this is gonna go. Guys. That's how well it's gonna go. With my lack of swimming skill as well. I think this is a situation where Daggerfall Dungeon wins and I lose. Of course, we can swim down. Actually, I don't think I can. I'm not good enough at swimming. I'm a loser who loses things. Nah. So, good dungeon, everyone. I'm going to load the game, go back to the Fighters Guild. <laughs> no magic. So that was good. I'm glad we had that moment together. Let's pretend we didn't do that. That was our punishment for breaking him. I'm not gonna use cheese. The hell. I didn't load up Daggerfall just to cheat my way through it. Suppose I could have uh, tried to wedge myself into the void, but I don't think that would have helped me out in that situation. Hello. Thought I was a sorcerer? I see. That was weird. Yeah, sure, why not? Newick, I can do that. The pawn odd pawn brokers and Newick. Take forever. Forever. What time is it? That's too late. New week? There. Cautiously. I think a little bit of lag. Uh, which is interesting. Maybe it's just due to the the window scaler that I have this thing at. I'm noticing that whenever it's doing some loading. Hi. The odd pawn broker. Mark it on my map. Marked it on my map. Thank you. I need to turn that down a little bit in my head. Yeah, I don't know how the game thinks I'm a sorcerer. This fucking playthrough is so foobar. Okay. Let's go. Enjoy this game. I played it rather extensively, and I'm discovering new glitches that I've never seen before. What time do you open? Nine o'clock, huh? We can do nine. Huh. That was a very rubbish health game. Wow. Of a maximum of 30, that turned out pretty bad. Oh well. 
Let's be luckier. Yeah, it's pretty quick and easy to get to level 2. Hello. Yes. I will try to get past the Infernal Necromancer's Lady, but I make no promises. Let's go! That's not the right button. What button is it to look at the clock? Status? I... Okay, good, it's open. Hi, guards! Hi, guys! How's it going? How you all doing? You come here often? Hi! The cart doesn't cost that much. It's the horse that costs the most, but you don't even have to buy the horse, so long as you're willing to deal with the cart sounds. <sighs> Shut up, big. Yo. I think because my magicka is so rubbish and I can't recharge it normally, uh, sorcerers in this game uh, can't recharge their magicka normally. Uh, like if you say pick the sorcerer class. So the mage's guild will give you a refill. It's just that because of what I chose, the game in this case is kind of treating me like a sorcerer and refilling my magicka for me, which then immediately crashes because I'm not allowed to cast things ever. Ever. Look at that, it's like constantly oscillating between 0 and 9. Should be wacky -o. I don't think I can do that. Oh, Frostfire! Sure, whatever. I'd like to do a defense of the guild one, but they're not offering me that. Alding Wark, Akatosh Chantry. I can make that happen. Go! Good time. Map. Okay, I only see the one temple. So I think that'll be fine. That's the Temple of Canareth. Silly me. Should be this other building, I think, that's the Chantry? Hi. Let's go ahead and ask. Local temples? Is it, uh... Did I go to the wrong place? What the hell am I? Alding work at a place called... Is it a house? What the fuck? It's not a tavern. Is it a gym store? No. It's not a general store. It's not a guild. It's not a temple. What? What? No, we, we are supposed to go to this place. Where we went to, right now. We are in a town called Aldingwark. We're supposed to come here, to Aldingwark. Where this guy... I suppose I can ask for the person. Hey, you. Tell me about people. He's at the Mage's Guild. Because that's what we call the Akatosh Chantry. The Mage's Guild. Of course! How didn't I know that was the alternate name? You're gonna be locked for a few hours. <sighs> I 
constantly keep jumping in the air. Because I'm too used to spacebar being the activation key in this game. I fucking changed it. And it is fucking with me. Alright, where the hell are you? That's Spellmaker, lass. This is gonna be magic item, dude. You're a spell, dude. You're gonna be make magic items, dude? You are. Up here? No. Up here? Cool. Back to Gothway Garden we go. Also, yes, I did get a letter. I'm sure it's necromancers wanting research. Grimith, do not make an enemy of the Dark Brotherhood. We can be... We can be... Great help to one another, but you could not wish for a worse enemy. When you have the research paper... Bring it to the Superior Supply Store in Gothway Garden. Fail not, or the wrath of the Fala, Queen of Oblivion, be on you. How about, go fuck yourself? Ever think about that, lady? Ah, but you didn't. But you didn't consider that option, motherfucker. Yes, they're writing in the only way my character can understand. But of course. I can't rob shops. I don't have. I can't get a lock picking spell. It's not a thing I can do. It's not a thing I can do. That's right, an elf with no magic. Fuck you, I do what I want. I break racial stereotypes. You know, I wonder if that constantly oscillating number is the cause behind the game breaking. I almost never do a non-magic type thing. Like, at least I'll limit myself to, like, no magic a day so I can do stuff at dungeons. Or at night. So weird. I think I misspelled that. Whatever. No, I'm not capable of casting sleep. I don't feel like hunting imps. You fucking people are breaking my balls here. Kathleen, the Kingford residence. Fuck your letters. Fucking, fucking boring ass shit. I need, to, I need to start fighting people soon. I'm getting a little antsy. My character was born to fight. It's fucking, it's getting to me. I'm getting a little stir crazy. Need to start crushing hopes and dreams. Oops, ran past it. think you're the research dude. His sprite looked too normal. They tend to be up these fucking annoying ladders.
Why the fuck is this formatting fucked up? What in the ever-living shit? That's not supposed to be fucked up. I've read that plenty of times without being fucked up. <sighs> Why are you breaking every single ball I have? What the hell is this shit? The Bat and Stag Pub. The fuck is this? <laughs> Seen all kinds of new shit. I'm not sure whether this is due to the resolution I'm playing at. It shouldn't be it. Whether it's due to my character's poor intelligence? I don't think that'd be it. Whether it's due to the... The unofficial patched version that I'm kind of using? I want to blame that because I love blaming user modifications. Alright, so... I got the research. Let's go to the place with the people. Let's look up the Bat and Stag pub first. No. Alright, let's run here first. Let's go meet with the lady. So there's a town named Bat and Stag pub. Yes, and it has a tavern in it. Do not fucking question this game. Should be over here. Hello. How's it going? Ah, thank you for responding to my letter, Grimoth. I am Lady Bree. Let me bring you to date on affairs. Lady Bree, it's important to meet with her. She contacts you shortly after your shipwreck. Uh, you meet with her. You can progress with the main quest, your leisure. If you piss her off, she'll give you, like, another chance, and then the main quest is forever closed to you. The specter of King Lysandus haunts the streets of Daggerfall at night, trying to communicate with him. Don't be in the city of Daggerfall at night. Bad things happen. And so, suspects include nobility. And then the letter... She's fucking useless, basically. And she's leaving. Don't mention her name in court. Cool. Bye. I'm gone. We need to use a more convenient mages guild than this one out here in the bumfuck middle of nowhere on the other side of Daggerfall. It's not really helping my travel time. What time is it? That's just enough time to swing into the mages guild. Really, though, I need to start killing things. I might start attacking crypts of all things. I might accept a random dungeon. <laughs> I gotta take a look at this thing Bassman sent me. God damn it, chat. Stop fucking scrolling. Stop typing your pussy ass shit things that don't matter. <laughs> this isn't a plugin. I uh, am using open broadcaster software, and I have it set as an overlay. And I use a color key, so it makes the background behind the dashboard chat disappear. So, what do we want him? Uh oh. I fucking click on that, and that ruined everything. Shouldn't have done that. Now whenever I try to go to my activity log, fucking slacks or stupid fucking image is blocking all my shit. Blocking my controls. What? What the? 
No, I didn't want to ban him. God damn it. You know what? Fine. I don't want to make him a moderator. I don't want to make him a moderator again. You know what? Fuck you, Hitbox. That's not important. God damn it. You know, I don't even care anymore. I'll mod him later, again. I know, he's getting blamed for all kinds of stuff, but it's not even his fault. Yeah, if you were in the chat, I could, I could do that all again all easy. Now, do you have an interesting quest for me? No. No, I'm not loyal. Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, I can do a guard thing. I'm into it. Hi, guys. I'm ready. My body is ready. I... Hey, don't be shooting. Look here, boys of God. Gee, I'm all scared and shaken. Let's leave the tongue on the door as a warning not to mess with the Thieves Guild. Get out. You want a piece of me, boy? There, my bloodlust has been sated. Take a look at the helmets just to make sure of quality they are. Both plus ones. It's a plus one as well. Damn. Let's go ahead and remove that. Put that in there. Do that, 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 that. Need that wagon. It's all good. I won my prize now. I win. Prizes? Prizes? I... I successfully guarded. Yay! I win a turquoise. I did it. I did it. I did it. Yeah, Louis C. Mouse. That's how that goes, right? We'll keep that name. Mission accomplished. No. Give me more kill things. Give me more convenient kill things. I said more convenient. More? No, no. Can't do it. The... No. This, uh... Unofficial stuff adds some quests that I'm not too familiar with. I did allow the game to add those unfamiliar ones. And this whole text about constantly recharging me is getting a little irritating for me to constantly click through. Can't do it. Wait, no, no. You are not helping, dude. I don't want to get on the darker side of gods. Work with me here, man! Oh, for fuck's sakes. Alright, I'll accept something dumb. No. Listen, I'll accept something dumb. Yeah, I'll fight him. Whatever. Hmm. <laughs> 
Holding work, huh? Yeah, sure, whatever. I didn't mean to save. Try to save there. Let me tell you how well this is gonna go, folks. It's not. Holding work was down here somewhere? That was Newick. No, 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 no. Okay, I got the name wrong. Alding Wark. No, not Alding Wark Wood. Alding Wark. We're actually attacking a mage's guild. We'll just go ahead and wait till fucking dawn, I guess. I kind of need to go shopping anyway. I don't care how kind of quality the general store is. Let me in there. Practical place? Yeah, sure, fine. Take all of my stuff, take my, my stuff, take my, my stuff, take it all, please take it all, gonna buy me a wagon, got me a wagon. I remember back when wagons used to carry a thousand pounds, I had to stop I'm carrying all this damn armor too. I forget that I can't sell that at general stores. I go like armorers to do that crap. All right. So we're looking for a mages guild, and we've kind of already been here before on a mission. So it's kind of like we knew where the mages guild was already. How about that? Now we just need to loiter for a bunch of hours. Holding down my J key because that used to be my jump key for ever so long. But I made it space. Hi, barrels. How you doing? I'm fucked. <laughs> Whenever I said I was fucked, I didn't think the game would crash. Surprise! Well, let me adjust something. No, let's not change things. I'm live broadcasting. No time for change. Remember all that stuff we just did? What if I told you we got to do it again? You'd be like, fuck yeah! We get to do it again, yeah! stuff, buy all my stuff, buy it now, buy my stuff, buy it, so I can have a wagon for things, that's not the button I want to press, five, no, six, put the wagon in the wagon, then you have a, a wagon wagon. Save. Need to run south, I think. Eh. Uh, I've played Arena a bit. I don't know it as well as I know Daggerfall. <laughs> Whether that's a good or bad thing, that's up for you to determine. Finished loitering, yay! Need to wait for two more hours and then some change. 
I think this will be good. I think. Yep, totally needed protective spells like a shield, guys. Yep, that was a thing. That happened, everyone. Cool. A dungeon location. That's where I'm gonna be going to. Man, guys, that was... that was... that was really tough. You really couldn't take care of that? Really? You motherfucking lazy bastard. How about you? Oh wait, wrong room. How about you, training guy? How about you, spell lady? That's uh, identify lady. None of you? Huh? Spellmaker? What about you, buy magic items guy? Useless asshole. I know. I'm level two. These guys don't really have a whole lot of spells on them. It's pretty nice. Lady! Let's go back to Gothway Garden, because I still don't know better. I'm just gonna keep going here. Because I'm so emotionally attached to it. What time is it? That's good enough. Let's go northwest to get fucked. I know, barely got out of that one alive. Big boss fight. <laughs> well, the, uh... The disadvantages I chose kinda, kinda make the no magic thing pretty cut and dried. Magic items, though? I'm totally cool with magic items. I'll just have to, uh, work myself up to being able to, uh, get magic items. Of course, make magic items. Which means I'm actually gonna have to train my magic skills up a bit. Which is funny. Oh, the great and evil mage is no longer raising all hell, and you are alive. You have accomplished your task, Grimith. The guild is forever in your debt. Enjoy your 100 gold pieces, 80 gold pieces, friend. You deserve every bit of it. Holy shit. Have I ever heard of the necromancers? I'm not gonna stop the necromancers. Eh, yeah, whatever. I'll have to wait for a bit. I can wait. Come along, you little thieving bastard, so I can wreck you. I love the aura, like humanoids project in this game as they just walk around opening doors. It's, uh, entertaining. Give me your stuff. Put it in the bag. Put it in the bag. Put all of it in the bag. In the bag, with the stuff. Good. You two, bag. You as well. No. Bye. The guild is forever in your debt. Take the 180 gold pieces. 
Let's get on with it live. Oh, I guess we'll have to wait for a bit. For like another two hours and some change. Might as well just make it three. It's a nice, uh, change. You know, my normal playstyle has me emphasize so much magic and shit that it's so difficult to take these guys down. But with my ebony dagger and all of my skill, well, not my skill, just my attributes, it goes pretty quickly. I like it. I got my own sapphire, yay! I got sapphire. Let's equip them in that order. Yes, that's important. Don't care about your research. Fuck your research. Dude, I'm not one for research. I'm a problem solver. I don't solve those problems. I don't I also don't hunt astronauts. I don't want to go to that laboratory. We've kind of been there before already. Help me out here. No, no Atronach disposal. Not that one. Not imps. No, no, I'm definitely not Grimmins. It's not me. I know I'm not hunting Basilisk guy. You know what? Fine. Fucking fine. Fucking fine. Fucking necromancers fucking riding your dick, giving you so much trouble. Fuck it. Fine. Sure. Fuck it. Fine. Where the hell am I going? Hockton's guard. Shit, that's so far away. So we'll have a few days to resolve this. It's so all my put those in there. That's about as well we can do. Let's do this. Dungeon ties me, Captain. We're off to a great start. My dungeon, my method of exploring dungeons, pretty haphazard. And I'm not really going to do a good job of looking out for secret doors and passageways. Oh, and if you're unfamiliar with the map system in Daggerfall, have a look. It's pretty delicious. Hey! got burglarized. Silver Claymore, not bad. I'll carry that. I can sell weapons in general shops, I can't sell armor. Silver Battle Axe. I'll take it. I have not tried to cast a spell, I suppose I could. Nah. Doesn't look like it. These skeletal warriors can be really brutal on low levels. Isn't that right, Train? That's the sound of something that could paralyze me if I wasn't immune to that. Yeah, I, I can't argue with that logic. I mean, anything could work in Daggerfall, right? Isn't that right, Train? Yes, yes. It's so amusing to, uh, to play and hear other games and hear that in action. I do believe I heard the Skeletal Warrior sound in Harvester, among other things. 
I recognize song it sounds from Daggerfall and like other games and like TV and I go, huh. I hope I don't have to do any sort of uh, platforming through those holes. That'd be awkward. Just want to find the quest location and go. Through my haphazard running around. I'm sure I'll luck into it. And then I'll have to try and find my way out. Hmm, that was close. Not really a whole lot of jumping room here. Well, welcome to the void, everyone. We're half in it. Come on. No? Hmm. Fine, fall down then. Or, I mean, we could not fall. Sure. Okay, we fell. Stupid bat. So, the best advantage of no spell casting without an item for recall? We don't have, well, recall. Which means. Without me using that beautiful Daggerfall teleport command that exists in the game, I, uh... I gotta get out of these dungeons all by myself. That's the worst part. These dungeons. They are maddening. You mean nothing to me, spider. sound. That was the sound of things doing stuff. You can also use uh, another one of the cheat commands to teleport between special locations. This is a circumstance where I would have been paralyzed were it not for my high elf advantage. Ow. My face. That hurt. None of those are really valuable enough to pick up. Hi. Looking for a wizard. Trying to kill necromancers here. Have you seen one? Don't you start communicating with me. Listen, Daggerfall. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Run. It's the only way. Locke has nothing to fear from me. Damn. Damn you, lockpicking skill! Why did I pick lockpicking skill when I can just beat through doors again with my weapons? Is that because I wanted to try to steal from shops by opening the doors? It's not like I really had any other important skills to pick anyway, come on. <laughs> Is there a secret door in here? No. You. That was fun. I like the part where he died. That was a pretty good part. Yeah, I know one chance. I'm so unused to using lockpicking. Alright, I feel like we've been here before. We've been here before, we've been here before. Oh my god. It's like a loop. And if we go back around, it's like a loop. No way. <sighs> Insanity. By the way, folks, this is not how you should explore Daggerfall Dungeons. I am a trained professional. I have explored 
many Daggerfall dungeons in my day. I know precisely what I'm doing. I know the quest locations. I know how modules look. Don't you make sounds at me, dungeon. I know you're moving things without my consent. Hi. The reluctant sage of Daggerfall. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure I didn't want to equip all those the same quality. It's a matter which helmet I like more. That one shows off the face. Hello. More skeleton warriors than you can shake a stick at. Ooh, fancy. Again, I'm too unused to being this effective in melee at the game start. This is weird. Too used to being shitty because I have magic abilities that are rubbish at the start of the game. Hello. Although I am running a bit low on health, I have taken a lot of punishment. Ha. Huh. Just gonna leave that one alone. And pray we never have to come back to it. Look guys, if you could just send the offending wizard out to me, we can get this done real fast. Also, hello. That's how I look, by the way. So manly. Such man. <laughs> Alright, let's go up the stairs. Now, if I were a quest location, where would I be? I don't like the fact that sound happened. No, it didn't have to do with that. stop being full of hubris. Let's go ahead and rest until fully healed. Which does not take that long for my character. My skills! Arr, thanks for letting me sleep, brah. So is this even a thing that you guys are enjoying? I'm curious. <laughs> I mean, it's Daggerfall, so how fun, how much fun can it really be, right? I'm sure my haphazard exploration will not uh, come back to bite me. Yeah, veterans like me. I've been in a few Daggerfall dungeons in my day. I thought this looked like an important room. Motherfucker's trying to shoot me with arrows. Hello, Grimith. I have heard of you. You were sent to kill me. But you are too weak. You know too much for me to let you leave. You must join me. 
as an undead sort of, Will you shut up back there? Shut up! Give the dwarves back their treasure! Mom! <laughs> I'm just gonna let him go for a bit. He uh, has a lot of crying to do. <laughs> you don't even have lungs. No, please. <laughs> Will you shut up? Shut up. Shut up. I love he's like, you'll become an undead minion. No, please spare me. <laughs> yes, meanwhile, in the background. I doubt we would have seen them at our current character level, Larian. Okay, now it's time for the greatest fuck you. Figuring out how the hell to get out of this mess. Unfortunately, Griffith does not possess photographic memory. This is a severe limitation in his life. Now, we do have some perks. On this thing, uh, the red square is us. And the blue square is the dungeon exit. You would really want to use a recall spell to teleport back to the people who gave you this quest. But I don't have any magic. So I'm going to have to rely on my veteran navigation skills. I just cried a little on the inside. I'm right on top of this thing. Huh. Down here. No, there's like a staircase involved. Let's go back. <laughs> Look at this photograph. <laughs> I mean, does it really hurt if we explore new areas and conquer them? Does it really? He said, chuckling. Oh, oh, I suppose. I could change it to this perspective. Better one or better two? I think this is the exit area right here. Because of that staircase. Although I don't see the door. So if I wanted to get to this area, I would first sob. And then I would turn around. Rather... Can we go south? Yeah, let's go south. And then... Turn west? And then go this way? And we should reach a stair... Oh, I remember this place. I remember this place. Son of a bitch. I don't think this was it. This was not it. Fuck me. You chose incorrectly. You have the advantage of 3D spatial exploration directions that I have the downside of not being grown. <laughs> I don't want to lose your love tonight. Really, it'd be more beneficial if I just ran around randomly. I'd eventually make it back to the dungeon exit. I did it once before, damn it. I could do it again. Do you remember? I don't remember. If we just go to all of the places I've been, I'll eventually find it for sure. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> oh man. It all looks the same. There's no landmarks. Oh, I missed my turn already. Look, we're training our skills up anyway, guys. We'll be fine. I remember this. I think we're here. You know what Grimoth did? Highlighting. Grimoth forgot that his jump key is now space instead of J. Because he's, play he's played this game for way too long with hotkeys the way it is. So, here we are. Just kind of hovering here. Half in the void. Half not in the void. I'm gonna have to load the game. I wonder, would this work? Oh, it does! Fantastic, I don't have to turn on cheats for that. Fuck you loading the game, let's try that again! That's, that's the command for if you get stuck in the void. Jump in celebration. Alt F11. I'm so glad when they added that to the game. <laughs> That's the save your fucking bacon command. Fucking music. Would be an all beautiful and stuff music. And I don't care whether we sell all of our stuff in a bad shop to sell it all in. You know what I should do? Save the game. <laughs> and jump for joy. You! Buy my things. Thing. Buy now thing. Thing, buy my thing. Don't even care about trading my mercantile skill. Just take it. Please give the cute spiders a ball of yarn. <laughs> well, I might be suicidal enough to attempt another dungeon. I did say that I, I might very well go past midnight. That is, uh... 1151 currently. We'll see. We'll see what kind of mission we get. <laughs> Can I replicate that? That was fun. Whee! I gotta do that again. I love this game. Oh, I wasn't as good. Oh, it's fine. Hi, guy. When they leave their operation die, all the other mages flood the air. Yes, all the other mages. I'm truly a great hero. Yes. That's why you paid me 206 gold pieces. Also, what the hell, inventory? Quit being back. Give me stuff. No, I don't want to hunt it. No, I don't want to deal with that either. I'm also not in the apprentice because I don't like that. Yes! Yes! I like this one! Yes! Give me your magic shit! Give it to me! So Taco. That was the thing. You think you can hit me with that scrub tier? You can decide, apprentice. Well, we mean to. <laughs> Scrubs.
Yeah, yes, man, that's uh, what happens whenever you uh, tank your intelligence and wisdom. I'm not used to it either. So it's pretty fun to kill people this fast. I'm not gonna admit it. I'm not gonna admit it. The hell with that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm too used to my high intelligence uh, builds with like shoddy personality and luck. Here, I mean, I even have decent personality. My luck's almost 100. Excuse me as I strip these these dead women. I like my women like I like my coffee. Ground up and buried in the freezer. <laughs> right. So that was a thing. Well, Lux, my attributes are normally capped at 100, and I would need to do some real magic item fuckery in order to, uh, do all that crazy shit. But my luck as a result probably won't go into the negatives like his did, so that's a thing. You. Thanks for recharging me. Makes me feel like I'm playing Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. Oh, yay. Torque of friendship. Whenever the uh, the ladies are all like, "Yeah, I'll fucking help you," and then they open their door and you walk in, and suddenly you're rejuvenated. So maybe one more quest. Something more convenient? I wouldn't mind doing one of those defense things again. Clap, clap, defense. I don't even remember what time of day it is. Probably not even enough. Yeah, I'd have to wait for a while. Midnight is too far away. It's too far. Don't even care. Guild business of the greatest importance. No astronaut hunting. No research getting. Yeah, sure. You don't discipline me, girl. This crazy mage no doubt knows the plans to kill him, so you must be wary of traps. You may be guarded by other mages serving him, so expect quite a fight. Yeah, yeah, sure. Murr castle. Fucking Atronach hunting. So dumb. I don't even like coffee. Hi, horsies. Stupid fog. Alright. I believe that's the Mage's Guild. It's the only blue building here. Suspicions confirmed. Hi, guards. Bothers me that I can't press the same hotkey I used to open the minimap to close the minimap. Escape work? It does. <laughs> Shut up, horses. Oh, I haven't rode this yet. That's right, whenever you buy a cart, you get a free horse. You just have to listen to the cart sounds. They throw in a horse for free. They're pretty nice guys like that. With that card, yeah, card strafing. Okay. Ooh, different layout this time. I like it. Well, that was easy. He had a rose for me. I don't really want his. His hand-me-down rose, though. Bye, guy. What time is it? Okay. Right next to the Mage's Guild. How convenient. Now let's wait for a few hours. Hi! 
everyone. How's it going? How you doing? You guys want to mingle? I mean, we can mingle. Want to mingle? You guys are doing some crazy glitching effects there. So I'm just gonna stand here and loiter for a bit. Hi! I... I see. Okay. Yes, forever in my debt. Yes, you are. Okay, so, that was the first broadcast of Daggerfall, and I had so much fun that I might try and do it again after, uh... Everything. Reasons. Maybe I can see if I can fix the frame rate a bit, although, uh, given the windowed stretching and the scaler and the fact that I'm live broadcasting and local recording, that's fine. We just don't have any desync issues. Also, let's have an outro full of death. Hmm. You can't make me. Not gonna be able to do it, guys. Sorry. How would playing Daggerfall be without this, right? I think I'm gonna need a Daggerfall guard emoticon. Ah! No! Get wrecked! You can't make me! You hit me, which means I've been triggered! You triggered me! You can't stop me! No one can stop me! I don't even care about your things, because this is an alternate universe! Who's gonna make me halt? You? You're gonna make me halt? Going toe to toe without even really dodging. Come on! Come on! Oh, this is a postal mode. I don't have the cat silencer. What? 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 We're gonna have to glitch out to stop me, game. The blood orgy continues. I am a scoundrel. Only a scoundrel? It's kind of insulting, game. Fuck you, Surrender! Yeah, right! I'm a criminal now? How smooth am I? I'm pretty rough. I feel somewhat bad at- Ah, dick! You've ruined it! No! No! I have been poisoned! They ruined my fun! They did it! They ruined my fun! Sue criminal. <laughs> Damn them for poisoning me. Must not give up. Keep the dream alive. Temple, please, 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 temple. Do you have a cure poison guy around here? I know you have the cure diseases, lady. Is there a cure? Please. Die. I don't think they do. Hmm. At least not that temple. Oh, this is awkward. Please. I'm too beautiful. To die. Well, 
I can't buy potions uh, from these guys. I'd have to uh, join their guild and get some ranks first. But, you know, I just endured the poison. I got better. The poison faded. Which means I'm still alive. I got better. I know, I slaughtered half the town. Are, are you seriously not triggered? Really? I'm sure they do have some stuff. Well, I killed a few people when I came back out here. Like, I, I, I was swatting people and destroying them. It was just too far away from the care. It's like, not in my jurisdiction. I mean, it's stuff that you can sell. Not really that amazing. If you want, to, if you want the good stuff, you have to go to the danger taverns. Which I guess I might do during this playthrough at some point. Of course, not in this broadcast. Anyway, I kind of fucked up my equipment a little bit. I... Lunch break's done. Oh, 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 oh. I know, I stared him down and he finally did something about it, guys. I'm kind of proud of him. Out of here, suckers. Oh, oh. What? Oh. What? <laughs> you don't own me. Oh, oh. 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 I'm a villain. Oh. We can make that better in like three years. Oh. Oh. It's okay, I regenerate oh. health over time. Oh. Oh. Slowly. Could really apply yourselves better. Maybe you could like try running. I suppose screaming all of me works too. You see, look, my portrait in the bottom left is no longer red. That's the power to generate health. If I really cared enough, I'd min max uh, save scum. I know using that scummy word. Uh, phrase rather my uh, health so that whenever I level up I get more than the, the rubbish oh, amount of health oh. I got at level 2 but I don't care enough oh. I don't even care enough to do that for attribute points oh. although I did get the 6 last time that was pretty cool oh. Oh. come at me come on I got a horse oh. and a cart oh. 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 I'm strafing oh. and I'm moving backwards oh. Oh. And I'm attacking oh. you with a dagger. Oh. Oh. How are you not outreaching me? Oh. 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 Let's halt. Oh. More wreck. Oh. Come on. Come on. Oh. I'm gonna keep going until I die here, guys. 
There you go. <laughs> I just rubbed right up against his face and he applied himself. You were the chosen one! America, you be shot by now. <laughs> Alright. That was a great initial broadcast of Daggerfall. I am definitely playing that again on uh, Sunday morning. Uh, time unknown, of course, because I don't know when I'll be up and available to broadcast. That'll end the local recording here.